So, the whole film versus digital thing. I recently tried to take some photographs with the Voigtlander Besser 2, just taking portraits of my granddaughter, and it was a bit of a struggle to be fair, to get a snap focus in there and, and make everything really tack sharp. Part way through the shoot, I decided to take a few photographs with the digital camera that I got on hand, the Canon 1DX. So I thought we'll get a few portraits with that and see how it is. Just so easy, just so, as I know, just so quick, no grief. The pictures, uh, absolutely mind-blowingly beautiful. The tack sharp, focus was instant, the ease of use. So from that standpoint, I started thinking, why am I messing about with film? I had eight frames on the Voigtlander, but lost one early doors. I think I came out with about maybe two shots that I'm quite happy with. It was an absolutely unintentional comparison between digital and film. So check out the video, guys. You'll see the struggles I had with the focus, and you'll see the ease at which digital kicked in. After you've watched the video, it's a little bit long and drawn out. Sorry about that. We'll come back and we'll come up with my conclusions. So we've got the Voigtlander Besser 2. We also have some serious religious socks, very holy. We've got a roll of FP4+, plus, which I'm gonna rate at ISO 125. We have got a Sakonic light meter to record the light. We've got my beautiful little granddaughter. Hello, Amber Bamba, hello, beautiful. We've got an absolutely murky, horrible, mucky day outside. We've got eight frames on this roll of film. We're gonna get four frames of natural window light. That's the first thing we're gonna do. And then as we progress, we're gonna hook up the Besser to my old Prolinka studio light. I've not used this light in, God, so long, so many years, so many years. At least 23, 24 years since the last time I've used this, this light. So whether or not it's all functioning well, it seems to be okay. We're gonna see how it goes. From memory, it's a poor man's version of an Elinchrom. I've misplaced my umbrella, the diffuser umbrella. So I've got a blouse, not mine personally, but hey, whatever. It's the missus's and we're gonna use that as a little soft box sort of diffuser. So you just turn on the modeling lamp. It's quite harsh light. Put the makeshift diffuser on and it just takes the edge off a little bit. So we're gonna use that anyway. Let's just uh, point at my own bubbles there. Diffuser on. Uh, let's just give it a test shot. Woo! You think of that baby girl? Ambi Bambi. Ambe. Hey, baby girl. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, yeah, baby girl. Beautiful. All right. Four frames with studio light, four frames with natural light. We're going to process the film and we're going to scan them and we're going to see what comes out nice. Baby girl. Let's put you there. Put you there, darling. Move this and we're going to pop this over there as well. A little bit of space for us. How you doing, baby girl? Here you go. Here you go, sweetie. Take this off. Don't want your bib on there, do we, babes? Let's try and make some pictures. We can try and make some pictures, beautiful. Are we? Round about F4 at 1, 1 of a second. Let's have a look, see. See what the Besser will give us. Are you beautiful? I know. Let's see if we can make a picture of my little girl. Let's have a look. All right. Let's just set this then. Let's get a focus of your baby girl. Let's have a look. Bambi Bambi. Bambi Bambi. Let's see it. Where is she? Beautiful. I think I wasted that first frame actually. That might be dual exposed. So I reckon that's going to be a burner. So let's wind on to frame number two. Ideally we want to try and get some light coming through the window. Every now and then we get a gap in the clouds and the sun pops out and puts some nice light in here. He's trying, he's trying, is he baby girl? He's trying. The problem we've got is little Ambi Bambi has had a feed. She's getting tired and she might be getting cranky. You're just a big smiler. Yes, you are. Ambi, hello. Oh, oh, cool. Cool, let's see if I can get a shot of you doing that, baby girl. Are you ready? Ambi Bambi, just trying to get this focus right. Hey, baby girl. Let's see if we can get a little bit closer. Not sure how close we'll be able to get. I think we're okay there. I don't think we're far away. Amber, hello, baby. Hey, baby girl. Baby. Ar 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 gag 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 ah, gag 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 ah, gag 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 gag. What's Granddad doing? Been a dog. Ah, bop, 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 bop. Oh, I don't know. I think that's a little bit out of focus, actually, mate. Let's just try. That's better. That's better. That's better. Amber, 
Hey, yeah, baby. Hello. Oh, I ain't even freaking cock the shutter. Dickhead. Oh, nice. Now you perform. Let's try again, baby girl. Ah! Amber's turn. Beautiful. That was a shot and a half. That was a belter. Now that one, if that came out, I'll be pleased as punch with that one because we just got a nice little look in an eye as I took the frame. So hopefully that one comes out. Two frames in, I've just realized that the light coming through the window could cause a little bit of light flare. My particular Besser comes with a funky, cool as you like, lens hood. And just pop it on like so. You don't screw it at anything, you just pop it on there. There she sits, shields any stray light away. And uh, that is not me, by the way, just, uh, just to clarify, that is indeed the baby making those uh, raspberry noises, I assure you. Anyway, back to more pressing things. So the lens flare hood is now on. We shouldn't get any flare through there whatsoever. We're on to frame number three. Now it's getting really dark in here. All right, baby girl, let's have a look. Let's plug in the, where's the wire? Here we go. This is the sink cable. So I'll just wire the sink cable in. And then we're gonna pop this into the besser, which sits from memory underneath somewhere here. So the sink cable just sits in there, PC sink socket. And that should be all wired up now. Just cock your shutter, which is there. Set your aperture along here. Set your shutter speed along this serrated edge there. That there is your shutter release. Wind on your film with that knob, gain your focus with that there knob. And you can see, with the Besser, you can see the bellows moving in and out as you adjust focus. She's a marvellous, marvellous piece of kit, that is for sure. There you go, darling. Hey, sweetie pie. And then what I want to try and do is get a shot. Let's have a look. Put that curtain across it a little bit like that. Let's have a look. We're not too bothered about the background. This is just a, a bit of a test. I'm gonna gain my focus first. We're gonna kind of shoot down on little Amber this time. Amber baby, let's have a look. See if we can get a nice shot of Amber's bright, beautiful eyes. Quite hard to get a focus with this camera real fast because she's doing a lot of moving about. I think we might have a focus. Okay, let's just try it. And what we're gonna do first, of course, we're just gonna trip this out because I want to know exactly what my light is. So 1/125th is giving me F11. So that's not too bad. We are just about ready to take a little shot of little baby Amber. And it's, I'm just holding on the PC cable, make sure it doesn't drop out. Baby, Amber, where is she? Give a smile, baby girl. Beautiful. Is it beautiful? I don't know, I don't know. Because I'm really struggling with the focus. We've got a moving subject there, and my focus on this camera is quite awkward. All right, frame number four, frame number four. Hey, baby girl. I'm gonna drop this, I'm gonna drop this curtain back because I want a little bit of the light from outside to come in. Just turn that off because the diffuser's getting a little bit hot. Don't wanna set the missus' blouse on fire, do we? My little missus is getting tired, ain't you, sweetie pie? I think I'm just gonna try and get one more shot, guys, because uh, little Amber here is getting a little bit tired, ain't you, sweetie pie? And it's nap time. It's nap time, baby girl. Hey, yo, hey, yo. Let's give her a little toy to play with, what shall we give her? What about that, baby girl? What about that? That'll distract you, won't it? That means everything, doesn't it, baby girl? Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Don't do this, Missy, don't do this. Let's just try it. I want to get one more shot. I'll tell you what I might do, actually. We might use that there, and then I can get a nice focus on that, which will put Amber in perfect focus, methinks. Oh, don't move it, baby girl. Don't move it, baby girl. Let's pop it there, and that's, that's at the side of Amber's face. So now I can get a clean focus on that, which gives me a clean focus on the subject. Hey, baby girl. Where is she? Hey, yeah. Beautiful. Hey, you gorgeous. Hey, you beautiful. And now you bloody smile, you little monkey. I think we're gonna leave that for a while. We'll get her put down for an hour, get her an hour's kip, and then when she wakes up, she'll be absolutely buzzing, fizzing, big smiles on the dials. Oh, you baby girl. Yay! Yay, baby girl. A beautiful model, aren't you? Yeah. So we've got a real quick bit of sunlight coming through the window there. So we're going to change tack, change the light meter over. So let's have a look, sweetie pie. That's the light hitting in the face there. We're going to go with F4 at 1, 125th of a second. Look at that light now. Oof, that might have changed again. 
That is good light, that is good light. So F4 at 250th now. Let's see if we can set this before. I know, darling, I know. I know, baby girl. Let's have a look at you. Where is she? The focus should be something like still same. Hey, baby. Hey, baby girl. Amber. Where's a baby? Where is she? Amber. Oh, let's take him out. Tell that dummy out. You don't want that buddy dummy in. Where is she? Where is she? Oh, we need to bring you forward a little bit, baby girl. Just so you're in that nice light. That's the story. Hello. Beautiful. That's a nice shot. That's a lovely shot. Okay. So that was frame number five. Just trying to shield that light coming through the uh, the red window at the back. Just as we say that, the sun's going in again. So uh, that was quite a, a quick, opportunistic shot, wasn't it, baby girl? Are you getting so tired? She says, yes I am. Are you getting so tired? Yeah. What is this? What's this? What's this baby girl? What's this baby girl? Hey beautiful. Are your body beautiful? Yay! I've been wondering in this JCB. What I've decided to do, make sure I get a few nice photos out of the Besser. So I've got the same settings on the Canon 1DX as I have on the Besser. And I'm just seeing what the results come out like. And to be honest with you, my God. Hey, baby girl. I'm a bamba. What's this? What's this, baby girl? What's this? Hello. Hello. Oh, the results coming out of the cannon are absolutely stunning. Hey, baby girl. Hey, baby girl. Tired girl. Tired girl. Amber, one, two, three. I've been wandering in this JCB I'm five years old, my dad's a giant sitting beside me Now this is a 100mm f2.8 macro lens So I'm able to get in nice and close Far closer than I would with the Besser And to be honest with you, focusing is so quick and easy Hey Delin, hey Delin What is she? Beautiful yeah, I'm liking them. I'm liking them. They're beautiful, aren't they, baby girl? How beautiful. We're going to get rid of the uh, the test camera, which is the Canon 1DX. I want to slip back on. I just want to keep keep an eye on that, make sure we don't start a fire. That light certainly generates quite a bit of heat. I think I've wound on. I hope I've wound on. I hope, I hope, I hope I've wound on. Hey, baby beautiful. Where my beautiful girl? Let's just turn you, turn you that way a little bit, darling. There you go, baby girl. So difficult to get a focus on here. You've got two images in the rangefinder patch, and you've got to get them over overlapping. Sometimes you really struggle. I think that's okay. I think that's okay. All right, let's cock the shutter. Hey, Ambi Bambi. I think this is frame number five or six. I can't remember. Hey, baby girl. What's this, darling? Oh, not good. Amber. Where is she? With the baby. Hey, oh. Yay. All right. I'm going to do it. Bring that light towards me a little bit. A little bit more directional flash there. Let's have a look, sweetie. Should we do a couple more? I think we might as well finish this roll of film off because, to be honest with you, I don't think we've got any more natural light coming through that window anytime soon. Okay, frame number seven. We've got two left, baby. Then you can have your bottle, and then you can have a sleep. How's that, baby girl, eh? Not much to ask, is it? Hey, just behave yourself. All right, if she keeps still there. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Amber, where's that baby? Where's that baby girl? Hello, Amber. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, beautiful. All right, okay. Last frame, Missy, last frame. And I want a smile from you for this last frame. Dude, you've been a good girl. Uh, yeah, number eight. Here we go, showtime. All right, Amber Bambi. I'm not gonna mess with the focus because I think I've got it. I hope I've got it. Hey, baby. One nice shot, one nice smile, baby girl. What's there? What, what have we got? What have we got? What have we got? Let's have a look. What's this? What's this? What the hell's this? Hey, Missy Miss. What's this? This is actually the cat's toy. Here, babes. Here you go, darling. What's that? Let's see. Oh, oh, I don't know. Oh, what about that? What about that? Let's see if we can prop it in there. Let's see if we can prop it in there. Oh, jeez. Man. Never work with children and animals, they say. Focus, I'm, I'm unsure. I'm unsure again. I think we've got it. 
Amber, where is she beautiful? Oh, I'll tell you what, let's, let's get a little bit higher for this one. I've been wandering in this JCB. I'm five years old, my dad's a giant sitting beside me. And the engine rattles, man. Beautiful. And that, my little girl, is a rapper. All right. Let's just wind that film on. We did good there, baby. We think. We think we did. Now what I'm going to do, just to finish off, just until she uh, she gets absolutely totally brassed off with me, I'm going to get a couple more shots. Oh, that's something a bit gnarly. I'm going to get a couple more shots with the Canon 1DX. Woo! She's getting a bit warm in there, my girl. Oh, yes, man. <laughs> that certainly gets warm. This makeshift diffuser was getting really hot. The hood round here is so warm. In fact, it's not warm, it's bloody hot to be fair. So uh, we'll just kind of give that a miss. I'm just gonna use undiffused, undiffused flash for a few shots. See how it looks. Here we go. Where is she? You've got a tired face there, little miss, haven't you? My little girl's falling asleep, ain't you, baby? I'll try and get some catch lights going on. And bit. Oh. That's a beauty. That's a beauty. I like that one. One, two, three. Hey, baby. What's this? Yay. All right, guys. I think we're going to call that a wrap simply because my little girl is getting tired. She's getting hungry. She's getting over this modeling lark. Stroppy models. Stroppy bloody models, eh? What's this? What's this? What's this? <laughs> Big time. Come on, Dala. Come on, here we go. Oh, oh, she's doing it herself. How clever are you? My conclusion is, and the only conclusion I can come up with, I shoot digital all day, every day at work for the newspaper. And I just absolutely could not do without digital. It is just so fast, so reliable. It's got to be used. Shooting film is the absolute opposite of that. It's slow, it's, everything's got to be measured. It's got to be thought about. Every frame has got to be considered. You can't just blaze away hoping for the best, review the pictures on the back of the camera and, and say, yeah, I just need to tweak this, that and that. You can't, you've got one effort and that's your batter. But for all that, the two photographs that I got out of this shoot that came out sharp, they're without doubt my favorite photographs. The digital, okay, they're good. The film, they've got a character all of their own and I can't explain it. I don't know, I think because I shoot digital all day, it's just a nice challenge and a complete change of pace to shoot film. And I absolutely adore the process. That's why I, for one, will be sticking with film for the foreseeable, just loving it. Until next time, take care.